Melissa, you are the best friend that everyone hopes for. The one that will drop everything, that will do anything for you at the drop of a hat. In high school, during a sleepover, I woke up at the crack of dawn because the sun was blaring in. And you dropped everything, sprung up, and found an old blanket, crafted together this makeshift sleeping mask so that I could rest. You sacrificed your own sleep for mine. And I think that very small story says so much about you. My name is Sean, and I'm very, very proud to have been ordained with the great honor of best man. However, I think I narrowly only beat out Buddy, who you've learned is Nick and Melissa's beloved cat. The story of Buddy is that Nick came home late one night, quite toasty, and decided to let in and start cuddling this scraggly, worm-infested creature that had been roaming the streets of South Philadelphia. As we all know, Melissa has a soft spot for animals and allowed him to stay. They nursed him back to health, and now Nick has been converted to essentially the male version of Crazy Cat Lady. Welcome, family, friends, and loved ones. On behalf of Nick and Melissa, I would like to thank you all for being here this afternoon. Nick and Melissa have invited you here to this beautiful grove to show you a glimpse of an important piece of their love. Today, they will join their lives in a self-united marriage in front of their dearest family and friends. I, I want to take this time to just say a little bit about Nick and Melissa. When, I'll start with me. When he was a baby, he came out running. I, I swear he never stopped moving. People say, oh, all babies do is eat and sleep. Not my son. He just goes. I've had the pleasure of knowing him ever since college. We met in engineering class. And before I got to really know him, I just thought of Nick as the quiet guy who would fall asleep in every single class, right in the middle of his note taking. But he is so intelligent that he still always ended up with the best test scores. I think I really knew that Nick was special one summer afternoon when he spent over an hour discussing pepper varieties and personalities of peppers with my mom. Hi. You're beautiful. Yeah, do you like all this? And I was like walking up and my heart was beating really fast. It was like, oh. As the thread of life's shared experiences grow and intertwine, a beautiful tapestry of your love will emerge. And that love, once a delicate, tender, vibrant life reaching for the light and stars, will be deep-rooted, resilient, strong enough to weather any storm. Nick and Melissa, we love you, and may God bless your marriage. Nick and Melissa met in 15. I don't know, in Philadelphia. <laughs> so he went over to her and said, could I sit down? I would like to sit down and introduce myself. And she said, no, not now. I'm eating wings. <laughs> eating wings is a very vulnerable thing and not really that attractive. I can just imagine her with wing sauce dripping off her face and on her hands. And here comes this incredibly handsome man who just sees her and gets it. So he went back and introduced him and said, is this a good time now? <laughs> And, and from that time on, I guess that he got his, her number and they had some dates. We 
We've been waiting for this day for almost two years and it's finally here. You make life absolutely delightful and meaningful. See you later. Love, Melissa. I'm excited to see what the future holds for us and can't wait for this next chapter together. Your love, Nick. Nick and Melissa, this room is a testament to your love. I think I speak for all of us when I say that you are two of the most incredible people around. You're selfless, you're generous, and you're so full of love and spirit. They say that a successful marriage requires two people to fall in love over and over again. May you both continue to do that each day, learning and growing in your love. our glasses for you know celebrating Nick and I's new married life and to having a great fun evening. <laughs> yeah. Nick and Melissa from this moment forward you will never be alone. You will carry with you the love of another person giving you a completeness and renewed lightness. May your life together be immersed in love and excitement. May you strive to enrich each other in every possible way. And may you work to bring the peace you find to this world. It is their honor to now pronounce themselves as husband and wife. You may kiss the bride.